Good morning, David. Ollie here. Going to be taking you through a 2016 Ram 1500 Bighorn Eco Diesel in the classic body style. Great vehicle. Loads of features and options on this vehicle. I'm going to take you through the outside of the vehicle quickly first, and then we're going to go into the interior of the vehicle. Look at all the options that it has there. So let's take a quick look. There it is behind me. I'm going to flip you around right now. So here we go, 2016 Ram 1500 Classic Body Eco Diesel. Looks absolutely fantastic, really gorgeous chrome accents all around the vehicle. Starting from the front, so it has the three liter Eco Diesel engine. We've got the really nice classic body crosshatch grille with the slotted chrome inserts as well. We also just have the active grille shut just beyond my fingertips here. Quad lens halogen lamps with our Lexon Margard Polycarbon MR10 housing. Really nice front end chrome bumper with our fog lights and these heavy duty tow hooks are standard on the big horn as well our 20 inch rims with our goodyear tires as you can see with the ram 1500 badging with the nice eco diesel badging as well power folding wing mirrors and we got our school bus 3 headlights so these are power adjustable and power folding from the inside of the vehicle as well quad cab got our nice rain visors as well on the back we've got our five seven bed with our spray and bed liner just going to open the back for you here independent tie down hooks on every corner as i mentioned before spray and bed liner a standard classic ram 1500 badge and um, we've got our four and seven pin wiring harness with our two inch tow hook and our dual chrome exhausts as well full four by four on the fly big horn badging there as you can see moving around to the back on the interior of the vehicle got our full crew cab here Power adjustable, oh sorry, power up and down windows, 60 40 rear split with our fold out panels as well. It takes up to 300 pounds. And we have our built in floor storage bins on either side of the vehicle. 12 volt outlet in the rear and our center console as well. Two cup holders, two rear speakers. Going to move around to the front of the vehicle here, sit in the driver's side and show you what we've got there. Remote start system from the key fob as well. Just hit that twice and it does start up. So as I mentioned before, power adjustable wing mirrors and they are power folding as well. One touch up and down windows either side and you can control the wing mirrors heated. Power adjustable driver's seat up and down, side to side, all that good stuff. Dial shifter on the lights and on the transmission. So I'm just gonna jump in here quickly. Turn this to go. Diesel preheat is on, comes up with a nice 7 inch in-cluster display as well. Leather up steering wheel, heated seats, driver and passenger side, full Uconnect 4 system. So screen on and off as we went through all those features and options before, full climate control. Everything is customizable from the, uh, from the home screen as well. We have our rear power adjustable, or power sliding window, sorry. Dual zone AC, dial shifter, and we have our on the fly 4x4 system as well all of our cold weather group here and our 150 volt outlet nice built-in in-floor console as well two drinks holders big storage space dual storage in the front so an sd card usb port as well and additional storage in the rear nice premium cloth interior with the panel stitching so less wear and tear nice led touch lights as well and our preset garage door opener Big, big, uh, big, big space inside as you've been in one of these before. Very similar to the, uh, pretty much identical to the Sport. Full Alpine speaker system as well, so that's a nine speaker output. We've got our LED bed lighting as well on the uh, Chinzel light. Looks absolutely fantastic from where I'm sitting. Loads of space, lots of features and options, and fits the budget. There you go, David, a quick overview. See you soon, bye.